Freud. What happened to your luscious beard? I'm not Freud, you idiot. I'm the Queen of England. You... are not Freud? Good heavens, Einstein. Did you really think that? Then where's Freud? You didn't kill him and steal his luscious beard, did you? I'll fight to the death for it back. You fool. My wig shall never fall into your scientifical like hands. You old hag. You would turn to dust on the first punch. You call me an old hag. The most physical activity you've ever had was dry humping your dead cousin's corpse. Huh. This proves you know nothing. It was almost certainly quite wet and she was enjoying it. Besides, you took your turn on her longer than me and Freud and he had just sniffed three rows of powder. I was young and vulnerable. We were all curious at that age, especially you. I remember that for a few months all you came home with were male transvestites with Down Syndrome. They all had Crohn's disease, not Down Syndrome. Their faces were merely contorted in pain from the withdrawal after I stopped breastfeeding them with heroin. This is all beside the point. I think that it's only fair that I wear this luscious beard after your nuclear experiments made all my hair fall out. Fine. All I ask that is permission to periodically stroke it while masturbating. Very well then, 